All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. I'm gonna basically be showing you how to clear the new anvil stages or the new like stages, I guess they're not anvil stages. Uh, from this one, you can get awakening stones and anvils. So I'm gonna guess with that. And then this one will give you just costume enhancements. I'm going to be letting you know if it is worth. Um, so it costs 20 gold coins for the uh, cosmetic one and 30 silver coins for the silver one or anvil one. So I'm gonna be showing you a few things okay so I'll just register boom i have literally no coins so you know this will be rough all right so you have an hour to complete 10 stages 130,000 cc i don't even know what gear i have but just make sure that you actually have gear in your team already preset that's a pretty big one and also i'm going to take the time right now to uh thank you to my members i will probably pop something up on screen um, but thank you to everyone who has, you know, joined the channel, supported me in any way, and is greatly appreciated. And yeah, I'll probably be flashing up the names right now. Oh, they're tanky. Okay, so is this literally just like the first stage? Why are they... Why is my Eskinor doing like no damage compared to how he usually does? Hmm. Um, but yeah, if you want to join, there's a link in description because apparently the join button doesn't work or people just can't see it. Uh, and then there's also a Discord that you guys can join. If you guys would uh, like joining that, it'd be greatly appreciated, you know. Get notifi notified every time we go live, etc., etc. I am sick right now, so I don't know how much I could actually uh, do as of right now. So be patient. Uh, Alright, so we got ultimate. I wonder if we lose it next turn. I actually don't know. Alright, so they are pretty beefy. I mean, so that's kind of good in my opinion because, you know, it's not super easy where you can just put it on auto and clear it in like 30 minutes whatever it was it looks like you actually have to like somewhat try hopefully we get our ultimates still that'll be pretty epic oh you okay um well um let's just go ahead and one shot the little green goblin i should have probably went for the red guy actually uh that way i could actually do more damage but, you know, we have the, the rank ups and all that, so it's whatever. And then we get immunity next turn. Um, it looks like they actually block out all ultimates on this stage, which is just like, really? Why? Like, are you not meant to just be able to farm this? I don't get it. Also, I'm probably going to be making a video either tonight slash tomorrow morning. It'll probably be tonight. Uh, it'll be out tomorrow, though. Uh, my thought on Grand Cross right now, I've been thinking of doing it for a few days now, and I just haven't gotten around to it. But uh, if you watch any of my videos, you can kind of see where I am leaning towards this game. But yeah, let's just not get into that. Alright, so for some reason, this guy is very tanky. I don't know why, but he uh, just doesn't take that much damage. So hopefully this kills, because it blocks out ultimate gauge completely, which is honestly annoying. This has already been three minutes. How are you supposed to clear all ten? Excuse me? Bye bye. All right, so you get 21 anvils and some awakening or enhancement stones. Okay. Or that's how much I got. It's not guaranteed. I'll be doing one more and then I'll probably cut. And then I'll show you the uh, gold one. Um, so, yeah, let's just do that. Let's kill the green guy and let's fisticuffs uh, that man. He should be dead. Yeah, 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 yeah. For some reason, I thought I used the pumpkin bomb. So yeah, we got it. We got it. Oh, we got a gold one already. Epic. Do you have a tax sale? No? All right. Awesome. 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 All right. So what we're going to do? Target that guy. That guy. Anyway, hopefully it kills. Oh, come on. I honestly hate my lost vein. I bet you anything he has HP defense gear on. Do that, that, and then AoE rank up, you know, get all that OP buffs. Jeez, look, look at that. Gother did more damage than freaking Lost Bane. Makes no sense. Maybe I should put attack crit green Gother. I have that. It's a pretty fun combo, I'm not going to lie. Um, but, alright, so you need to go for that. 
And then you go for that. I feel Lost Vein should kill, hopefully. It was a rank three. Yeah, okay. All right, Eskinor, how much? Oh, beautiful. Can you one-shot this guy too? No, I, I don't. Why is he so tanky of all things? It's pretty annoying. Um, I don't know. Maybe it's a pass or something that I'm just not seeing, but it's very annoying. Please, just die. <sighs> he might just have type disadvantage or whatever. Like, if you get... You do much less type uh, disadvantage damage or whatever. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, one anvil. Let me just check my gear real quick. I'll be right back, by the way, because obviously you can kind of see what it is. Um, yeah, I'll be right back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I just wanted to show you a quick little thing. I think I figured out why he was so tanky. So I think you literally just have to uh, go for him first. And then the middle guy just isn't tanky. And if this doesn't work, well, then it was a fluke. Uh... Okay. Hmm. Well then, maybe I have to AOE first? Maybe I have to kill the side character? Because I killed this guy, and then I killed this guy, and then I killed the far left guy, and I did like 300k to this middle guy. What the flip? I'm already confused. Alright, uh, 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 do that, 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 actually, okay, that, that. And then maybe that, maybe that's what I gotta do. I don't, I, I, I don't really know. Hey, look at the damage that middle guy just took. What the flip? Okay, well now this guy's obviously not gonna die. He, he He's the only one on the field. But okay, never mind. I guess I was just wrong. I don't know. I thought it would help. Never mind. I'll be right back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I think I cracked the code in um, figuring out exactly how to like basically one tap the entire second stage. I guess it's technically two tap because you have to use an AOE and then you bonk the red unit and then you bonk the blue unit. I think you actually just have to use an AOE card, which I probably should have. Okay, we gotta go with the card anyway. We're fine, we're fine. But yeah, I honestly think that they literally want you to uh, do that. And I'm just like, bro, why? All right, um, so I'm gonna do that. Uh, that, oh God, is it actually gonna? Oops, I meant to use the punching one. I didn't do it right. Aw, oh, he's not gonna kill this guy, is he? Oh, he does, Meliodas, you're so good. Okay, so now right here, the second stage where this guy is in the middle is like super beefy and just, you know, tank, tank like a rank three from Eskimo. Like, nah, we can't have that shenanigans in the house. You know what I'm saying? We got shit cards, God damn it. Um, Can you please somehow one shot even though I know you won't? Please? Okay, so we AoE. That did damage, I guess. And bop, bop. Oh. But as you can see, we're already doing more damage. That was with a rank one. So I, I honestly think you're just meant to AoE every single turn in order to, like, turn off a passive or something. I don't really know. But obviously, you saw, I, I do do more damage. I don't know if the Lost Bane AoE works. I guess we can just check. Um, so what I'm going to do is AoE. Fist cuffs down, and then you know, a single target, hopefully going, hopefully killing these two, and whatever. Or he just wipes the entire field. So yeah, I think you literally just use AOEs on this phase, and you do more damage. It's really weird. But I'm not gonna lie, I didn't get that many anvils. I'm pretty sure I had less than 10 anvils because I just got done rerolling uh, Taizu's HP piece, and I didn't want to do any more because you know I, I didn't want to reroll like crit chance or something or whatever uh, the crit, crit resistance, whatever. Um, so if we go to this, how many anvils do we have? We have 200 anvils. Yeah, we got about 200 anvils from that. For 30 rare coins, I, I don't know if that's really that worth. It's kind of up to you. But in my opinion, I don't think it's that worth. Uh, unless, obviously, if you just want a bunch of SA coins and you only use this thing for SAing, uh, like all your anvil dungeon keys, then I guess you could do that and then just save up your rare coins and do this But it does cost a bit of stamina. So beware of that um, Let's see we get cosmetic upgrades from here. How many runs do we get? Uh, weekly unlock limit resets every month. Oh, is there only one? Can you oh you can only do this once a week? Okay, okay, so I guess we'll hop in 
We get seven runs. Okay, well, I'm gonna bring attack food. I don't have attack food. I'll bring pierce rate food. Sure, why not? You know, I never use that food anyways nowadays. Anyways, let's go. I'll just be showing you the first one, and then I'll be showing you how much I have. Oh, wait. Oh. Um, I have a lot of it, though. Hmm. All right, well, um, let's just find out, I guess. God, I hate this, because it's just like, I just want to double AOE and stuff, but no. Um, let's kill you. Bop, bop, and then let's just AOE, sure, why not? Get some better card draw. And they're so, they're pretty tanky, they're pretty tanky. God damn it. I don't know if there's a time limit on these, though. I don't know. Um, okay. Epic, you hurt me. Um, so let's just rank up. Let's do that. And that's a single target. Maybe we kill the guy in one hit with Escanor. I'm ready to go back to bed. I'm already feeling the um, effects. Ugh. <coughs> Alright, uh, uh, let's just do that. That. And then that? Sure. It looks like they block out your ults as well. Hopefully they clear my ultimate gauge, so I don't have all those ults in my hand. We're facing Dillard. Oh. So I'm curious, if I do this... I'm not even going to rank up, actually. I'm going to do this. Um, this, and then Lost Man in the middle. I'm curious if it's like the last one where if I AoE first, I do more damage or something. I don't know. I could just be crazy. I mean, I feel as though that seems pretty normal for Escanor. <coughs> oh, I have peanut butter in my throat. I had crunchy peanut butter, and it's literally the worst thing ever. Guys, comment down below. Do you like crunchy peanut butter or regular peanut butter? It better be uh, it's creamy because it's mo so much better. Crunchy is just an absolutely, like, abomination of pungin' men. Okay. So, yeah, they just seem pretty, uh, pretty tanky. That's pretty much it, so. I think I'm gonna cut. What do I get? Five, five, three, and then five. Ah! Alright, uh, I, I'll be... 60 stamina! Oh my lord, this is not worth, guys. This is not worth... I'll be right back, but I'm already going to tell you, this one is not worth. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we're back. I did my seven runs. It took me quite a while, and uh, I didn't get that much. I, I, I know I had at least one stack of each, so I got like maybe 40 HP ones, maybe like 20 of these. 20. Dude, that is the worst stage I've ever seen. Do not use that one. Save your gold coins for essaying. Um, I don't think I can do this one, right? Yeah, I only have three out of six. Uh, but you get from this one is essay coins, pendants, evolution pendants, uh, a hammer visal. I wish I could at least test it out, but I don't think I have anything. And I'm not spending gems because F that. Yeah, I don't have any tickets. So unfortunately, you will have to test that out yourself. Or maybe I will test it out in the future one day. But as of right now, I, I just can't. Um, so yeah, don't do the gold one. The silver one isn't that bad. I got 200 anvils in about 30 minutes. Uh, I mean, if you're in a pinch, you need it. Just do it once a week. Boom. I mean, obviously, uh, stamina pots are much more important. But if you need it, go for it. Uh, this has been revamped as well to where you can only get 700. Let me know down below if you would like to see a video on that. Uh, and yeah, hope you guys have an amazing day. Hopefully this helped. And consider becoming a member for only $1.99 a month. That would be greatly appreciated. I have a $4.99 and a $9.99 one as well if you'd like to support the channel in any other way. Uh, there's no extra benefits. Gonna say that right now. There isn't. I don't really know what I can even add as benefits to be honest. But yeah, have an amazing day. Peace out.